This November has been great for video game fans. We've got Call of Duty with its, uh, refreshed gameplay and epic campaign. Jumanji with its Kevin Hart. And off in the distance, another game mill game. Oh god, this one's gonna be awful. It really seems like we're returning to our early 2000s roots in grabbing any license imaginable and making a video game. Robocop was at least decent, Spider-Man 2 was also quite fun, but the pile of licensed games is almost always a pile of shit, which is our specialty. So today we're gonna be checking out another Tintin game that just released this week, and it's weird. It's, it's really weird. If you guys want us to keep playing these new licensed games as they release, just leave a like on this video and let's get into this. But first, a message from our sponsor. Opera GX! Some things in life are just boring. Like this image of a divorced dad. Look how boring it is. But your internet browser doesn't have to be. Opera GX has some insanely fun customization options to spice things up with GX mods. There's a massive library of background music, keyboard sounds, opening and closing sounds, themes and colors of the browser, dedicated wallpapers like this one, Saul Goodman, a personal favorite of mine. And disabling and enabling these mods is super easy from the sidebar. Maybe you're sick of your greedy browser sucking up all those resources you need for epic gaming. With GX Control, you can leave those 10 tabs of Minecraft images open while you game, and it's not gonna hurt your gaming performance. I mean, look at the difference here. Or maybe you want to stay up to date with great deals on games, new releases, and even even which games are available for free. GX Corner offers all of that. You don't offer that, divorced dad. At the end of the day, your current browser's bad. Get a better one. Click the link in the description and download Opera GX for free. Now let's get back into the video. Tintin Report on Cigars of the Pharaoh. The video game. Ah, magnificent cruise. Don't you think, Snowy? I can't tell if Tintin's a teenage boy or if he's like a 35 year old man. He's got like a receding <laughs> hairline, but he's like five foot tall. That's just what he looks like. Look at that hairline, dude. That's like a 30 year old hairline. Watch out! Pardon me. What is this guy doing? Why is he doing that? Get out my fucking way, man. He's drunk, dude. This is a cruise. All right, they're on a cruise. People are getting turned up. They're getting turned. Where's where's all the cool Disney characters walking around? Where's the water slide? No. Turn, turn. Yes. Yes. No. <laughs> no. Did he really need to swing around the pole like that, dude? That was so fucking extra. Oh no, not again. Next time you finish my pal. <laughs> oh, the oh, great performance. Oh my god, Tintin, you fucking asshole. Watch where you're going. Oh my god, Tintin doesn't care. He's like, I don't care about this guy's documents. What on earth? What if I miss? What happens? Does Tintin fall over? I haven't done a single one of these and it's still going. Ouch! <laughs> Ouch! Get out of here, scallywag! Oh, Nobody calls anybody a scallywag, dude. That's just not a word people use. We're on a ship, all right? Everyone talks like that, okay? That, that's what happens when you get on a ship. Everyone starts saying shit like scallywag. Oh my god, don't go in there, Tintin. Don't go in there, Oh my god, Tintin, dude. That's a fucking exhaust pipe, dude. I'm gonna go in it! Tintin was boiled alive. Why is that boy running? <laughs> <laughs> that's why, that guy's my favorite character. No, oh, get away! That boy's a thief! Oh my god, everyone's talking over each other. I feel like I've, I'm actually like mentally Deranged. I'm hearing voices in my head. Got it! Got it! Uh, stop right there! <laughs> Thief. Don't you move! What? Stop! Stop it! It's going into the water! Oh, too late. That guy's nose looks like a fucking bellin. <laughs> <laughs> That's perhaps the most phallic nose we've seen on Mind Pulp so far. It really, it really is, dude. I'm not sure if the Tintin like art style lends itself well to 3d models i'm just not doing any of these quick time events they're doing they're they're just doing it themselves they just do it anyway Ow. convince the sailor you're innocent but i'm not a thief i'm tintin the reporter i'm tintin the reporter i'm a 35 year old 14 year old boy <laughs> i'm tintin i'm a reporter tintin oh now that you mention it I think I read something about you in the papers. What's wrong with this guy, Max? Is there something wrong with this guy? <laughs> nah, he's fine. He's just a sailor. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 oh. And here we are in Tintin Reporter, Cigars of the Pharaoh. Wow. 
Look at this. It looks fantastic. Oh. oh. Okay. Find Snowy and the man in the top hat. Oh my god, the guy's head is stuck in there. Would you be so kind as to order me to give you these glasses, sir? Yes, I can do that. This game is f***ing weird. Who do I give this drink to again? I don't, um, um this guy. Just give it to this f***ing guy. This guy? This guy wasn't here earlier, so yeah, I'm guessing it's him. God, the animation is <laughs> <laughs> so creepy, dude. This kind of breakfast is not healthy for the heart. Enough. <gasps> oh my god. Okay, well, that guy just wasted all of his money on a ring and it got thrown in the ocean. And now he's just chilling out. He's just gonna enjoy the rest of his cruise, I guess. That guy could be like a monster in a horror game, dude. Everyone can. Everyone in this game. You know what? It kind of it kind of looks like it's like Skinwalkers, dude. Oh no! You know it looks like everyone. It looks like everyone has a mask on. Tintin reporter in the ship full of Skinwalkers. Maybe I could try to get something that makes the bar slippery enough. We could also just leave this guy there yeah. and just move on with our lives. You know. Yeah. Yeah. Because I have a feeling this guy's big ass head is isn't even going to get out of those bars no matter what you do. I don't know how his head got in there to begin with. Oh, let me guess. Is this the stuff we need? Is this like lube or something? Oh my god, what is that? Be careful! I'm waxing the floor! And it's slippery! Okay, Skinwalker. Can I borrow your can of wax for a friend? It'll just take a minute. Be generous to people who ask you for wax. That's my one and only motto. This guy's fucking weird. Man. Everyone is, dude. I'm, I'm telling you right now, we're on a boat full of non-humans. Like these are, these are like, these are like aliens that like took human skin and put it on their bodies. Ugh. That's a great idea for like a movie or a game, a cruise ship where where aliens invade and take over the crew. And there's a, then there's like an imposter among us. The bars are slippery, so time to push. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, you're gonna break his neck, Tintin. We're about to see this guy's ears get ripped off of his fucking head. He looks like he's enjoying it way too much. <laughs> it looks like he was... It looks it like... <laughs> oh my god, yes, dude. Sir. It's like he was busting a nut. I'll tell you a secret. A secret about something extremely secretive. Of the utmost secrecy. It's where the Pharaoh's cigars are. That's what we're. That's what we're figuring out. This map looks like it was drawn by a fucking five-year-old. What is that curious symbol? I think it's supposed to be a bollock. It's a fucking bollock. <laughs> it's a fucking bollock, and you can see the strand of hair coming off it. That is a pubic hair. <laughs> that's what you need to enter the tomb. A pubic hair from your bollocks. What do these hieroglyphs mean? It says that you must insert your bollock <laughs> into the pyramid. Uh, insert your bollock. One singular bollock must be inserted. Not two, one. It only one. takes one. One bollock and only one. And one strand of pure pubic hair. Only the finest pubic hair. Until tomorrow then, dear friend. Goodbye, little man. <laughs> This guy, this guy's on something. I think he's drunk. He's not drunk, guys. He's just eccentric. He's faded, bro. Look at his eyes. <laughs> he's faded out of his mind. You impudent little whippersnapper. How dare you meddle? You just call me a whippersnapper, dude? I will mess you up with one punch. I've got my one fucking punch, man. Oh, dude, here we go, here we go, here we go. Combat, dude, this is it. Oh, we're gonna beat the shit out of these guys. We're gonna pull out our one punch. Tintin died. Ow! Ouch! Ouch! I could listen to this all day. Oh, my hand! Shut up! On the count of three! One! Two! Three! You're not supposed to tell him when you're gonna punch him. It's like the easiest dodge of all time. They were the worst bodyguards ever. I wish that all the enemies in Dark Souls gave you a countdown before they uh, did their epic attacks. We get snowy mode as well. Oh my god, snowy sniff mode. You need a change of underwear. 
Okay, so we got we got some variety of gameplay. That's fun. We get to roam around as a dog. Ooh, he fits under the bed. Oh, hell yeah. Whoa, whoa. It's a cigar, dude. It's from a cigar. Oh, cigar of the pharaoh. This is the worst criminal ever, dude. You left that in the bathroom? <laughs> you just leave it on the floor. You fucking idiot. Someone who smokes was in our room. Nice work, Snowy. I'll take it from here. There was a frame there of Tintin smiling that is going to haunt me in my dreams for a long time. Oh, look at that. Ooh, this physics. Wow. Holy shit. We really are in the next generation of Tintin games. And I wish we weren't. Tintin and Snowy save the day. They took that picture at the official banquet the city of Chicago held in our honor after we fought Al Capone. They fought Al what? Capone. <laughs> oh my god. We figured out that he was committing tax fraud. Roberto Rastapopoulos, owner of Cosmos Pictures, the largest American cinema company. Oh, those fuckers, dude. He's one of the reasons why the actors went on yeah, strike. Yeah, Roberto Rastapopoulos with his $27 million <laughs> annual salary. Mel G. Ford to direct Arabian Nights. Really? Another adaptation of Arabian Nights? Come on, guys. Boring. Just make the Marvels instead. Make, make the next Ant-Man Quantumania movie. <laughs> you know, for all the times we've made fun of Ant-Man and the Wasp Quantumania, I have seen very few comments defending it. No, no, it makes sense. The Blue Beetle gets defended because people actually enjoyed that movie. Yeah. I don't think anybody enjoyed fucking <laughs> Ant-Man and the Wasp. Also, look at the top of Tintin's head. I feel like all of his hair is just combed over top, you know, like Donald Trump style. Oh. Look at the top. Look at the top. He's got a full on comb over. Look at the top of his hair. <laughs> Look at the top of his hair. <laughs> oh, we get to take a picture oh, of Snowy. Ooh, look at that. <laughs> take it, take it. <laughs> That's it. It actually went with that picture as well. Can I, like, look at that picture? Oh, yeah, there it is in your diary, dude. <laughs> That's going in my diary. <laughs> oh, I can take a photo of this. Oh, look this at that. This is a wow. photo of Ash, not a photo of Poo. It does kind of look like black and white shit, doesn't it? Oh my god, I can keep zooming in. What's the magnification on this thing, it's dude? It's got like a macro lens. <laughs> <laughs> it's like it's going all the way down to a molecular level. It's still going. <laughs> <laughs> uh. It's still zooming. It, I can't believe it's still going, dude. The zoom is still going. This is like, I don't even know what we're looking at anymore. <laughs> we're about to see the cells move. This is good. This is a good one. Take, take the, take that. <laughs> <laughs> oh my That's god. That's a great one. Is your name Tintin? Tintin? And is, is your, your name, name Snowy? Snowy? Oh. Yes, that's us. What? Well, well, well. The tip was true. That's opium. Opium? Wait, oh wait, wait, what? Oh my god. Oh my god, Tintin's going to prison for life. For drug trafficking. Holy shit. Oh, I know it. You can put him in this. Oh, 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 stealth Hello? mechanics. Oh my oh. god, stealth. Oh no. What do they do with the dog? They put that thing down or what? <laughs> Okay, so so we've got we've got stealth mechanics in this game, something I did not expect at all, really. Especially not as a dog. Whoa! Oh. Holy shit. Okay, you can go into third person just to like look around. Snowy can have out of body experiences. It might have been snow What is he doing? <laughs> oh, spring water. Wow, that guy's singing was fucking something. I don't know what it was, but it was something. Yes. <laughs> go, go, go out the window. Nice. Yeah! He crushes skull the in the piano. The and... Ouch. <laughs> <laughs> We're in the sailor's quarters. More people to avoid. More scary looking people to avoid. Oh my god. They kind of just walk around and stand and stare into nothingness. I don't think they're human beings. Did you see how that guy just moved? <laughs> That was uh, not normal. Oh my god, oh my god. Run, uh -oh. run, just run. Oh, oh. Gosh, I couldn't get <laughs> I just, the people, I'm not sure that the art style fits in this 3D realm that we're in. I just, like, look at that thing. That thing should not exist in 3D space. No, I don't, no. I agree. He's not gonna see me. That guy looks like Hello Neighbor, dude. <laughs> <laughs> he does, he does. 
Oh. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Uh, uh. Run away from hello neighbor. <laughs> oh! What the f Oh my god. <laughs> no. I was miles away from it. <gasps> Snowy! How did you Is this the good key? To be precise, this is it. Ha! Another case sold, Thompson. Indeed. Genius as usual, Thompson. Now we're both locked in here. Nice one, Snowy. Okay, that, that's that's epic. I think now I should be able to use this to go up here. Nice. There we go. There we go. Finally, dude, we're gonna get the f out of here. Oh my god, it's a fucking maze in here. Oh my goodness gracious. Remember in Batman Arkham when you have to go through the vents? This game's a lot like Batman Arkham. Whoa, where the f are we now? I, I don't understand where we are. This is the most insanely complex <laughs> ventilation system ever. I feel like vents aren't designed like this. Like, what is this no. part? No, I don't get this at all. How is this good for airflow? I feel like we've we've asked, like, vent technicians before. We have. We have asked them before, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I think someone responded the last time we asked them saying, yeah, that's not how vents work. I think it was the G-Force video. I can't remember oh, which yeah, one it was. Oh, yeah, that's it. That's it. I mean, if you're a vent technician, explain to us if that's how vents work. Because I don't think I don't think it is. That looks like a disaster up there. Mm, grapes and pear. Oh, dude, mm. no, dogs can't eat. No, 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 dogs can't eat grapes. They're poisonous. <laughs> oh, fucking hell, I'm going to die. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. We killed Snowy. He died. Well done, Snowy. I knew you'd do it. Shh, quiet. Now, go hide in case they spot me and you need to rescue me again. Snowy understands English. Snowy is perhaps the most intelligent dog known to man. Have you ever seen the movie Air Bud? <laughs> I have. I think he gets the, so he I'm takes here. the cake, dude. He's like a D1 athlete. Have you ever seen the movie MVP, Most Valuable Primate? <laughs> is that the one where he plays hockey? <laughs> yeah. Dude, it's so yeah, good, it dude. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, there's one where he's like a fucking skateboarder, one where he's a snowboarder, yeah. it's like, what the <laughs> uh, that, that That primate did a lot of things. Like, how much cocaine were people on in the 2000s that we were making those fucking movies? What you write in there? Is that your fan fiction? It's writing a bit of poetry, you know, things about, you know, being on the open sea with the wind in my hair. I don't have any hair. Well, I've got what I need to fix the cargo lift. Easy peasy. Let me put that in. It just floats what? in. Holy it shit, he's yet. magic. Tintin has fucking telekinesis. Oh no. Oh no. This looks like a fucking puzzle. Oh, oh for oh. fucking no. Okay, and the, the game won't really explain what we're supposed to do. I say you just start <laughs> clicking random shit. <laughs> okay. I guess okay. I <laughs> guess I fixed it. <laughs> I have no clue what I did. That's one of those puzzles where you just start flicking random shit and you just hope it works <laughs> yeah. out. Like honestly, that was uh, just man. Yes. <laughs> the elevator didn't even move. No, it's still up. <laughs> <laughs> uh. There's that guy floating on nothing. <laughs> <laughs> Once at the port, I soon found Professor Sarcophagus and made arrangements for our trip to the desert, unaware that the police were once again on our trail. Damn, we're being chased as a drug trafficker. It doesn't matter though, Tintin's on a mission, alright? He's on a mission to stick his bollocks into that fucking thing. <laughs> yeah, I forgot that's what we were trying to yeah. do. Oh, we met up with Professor Sarcophagus again. I don't know if he's the guy that you want going with you no. in the desert. No. He's a liability for sure, dude. If it's accurate, it's at this very spot that we shall find the tomb of Kiosk. What are we supposed to dig with our hands? Oh my, oh my god, dude, this is a disaster. What did I tell you? Here's the tomb! That's amazing! Oh, there it is! There it is! Nobody found this thing for a hundred years. It was like ten centimeters under the, under the sand. A cigar. A cigar here of all places. Who's been smoking doobies in the desert? <laughs> Ooh, look at this doobie. Maybe I could give it a quick toke. <gasps> what in heaven's name? He's gone. The Scorpion King got him. Oh no, Dwayne. Go on, Snowy. But be careful. It looked like a fucking storm drain. It really did, yeah. I think we might be in the sewer. 
I will say this game, it definitely looks pretty nice. Yeah, it does, of course. The environments look good. Yeah, especially this area, once we went into the tomb. This area, it's yeah. It's really nice. Well, the lighting quiet, looks nice. Now. The only thing that kind of doesn't look great is Tintin. His skin looks sprayed onto his face. Is it time for some epic quick time events? Oh, it's time. yeah. Oh, okay, so we can do a bunch of different shit going? now. Hell yeah. I don't even know why they show you the controls when they just prompt you every time something shows up. Yeah, yeah. You know? There's no extra difficulty mode or anything, yeah. so. Like, on the side it showed, it was like, jump over things, squeeze through. He's not going to be able to make that jump. Oh my god, he oh made it. Oh my god, he's got the hops, man. That was crazy. Woo! Nathan Drake wishes he was this agile. Dude, Tintin has like the vertical of an NBA prospect. This is insane. Oh god. Oh, don't step on the wrong one, Tintin. I'm stepping on the right ones. Nice. Got it. Have you ever seen the show MXC? No. You haven't seen MXC? Oh my god, I'll have to show it to you. They do like obstacle courses. Ah. And one of the obstacle courses is like you uh, you run along these these rocks and some of the rocks crumble and some of them some oh. of them stay up. It's like it's like Squid Game but nobody dies. Ah, you mean Mr. Beast Squid Game? Exactly, yeah. We had a show that was like it was like a kids show. I forget what it was called, but there was a big there was a golden monkey that people tried to get. Yes, Jungle Run. Jungle Run, that's, yes, it. that's it. Jungle Run, I remember that show. That's a classic. That show was fucking amazing. And from what I remember, they had like people in costumes. They were like dressed up as monkeys and they would like throw shit at you and stuff. Yeah. Yeah, insane. They would try and harass them. Like I said, dude, uh, there there must have been just an insane, absurd amount of cocaine during the early two thousands with the shit they were making. Like, where's the Jungle Run video game? We're gonna put a bunch of kids in a fake jungle, and they're gonna do an obstacle course, and we're gonna have grown men in monkey costumes throwing stuff at them as they do it. This is this is a pretty fucking long segment. If you wish that the LA Noir chase sequences were like ten minutes long. Then this is the game for you. Whoa! What? What the f is that? What is that Kool Aid? Mm. Oh, oh, that's good stuff. I don't think you should be drinking that, Tintin. It was fucking Drano. <laughs> it was ancient Egyptian Drano. That shadow doesn't make any sense. No, 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 no! It really doesn't. <laughs> no. How is it casting the, the shadow of the whole pot when it's in half? I don't know. Oh, I think it might have been fuel. I think Tintin drank some fuel. My tummy doesn't feel so good anymore, guys. Maybe we should find a heart and a feather and put them on the statue's weighing scale. That's where they would store organs, right? When they would mummify people, they'd like put them inside That's of those. That's where they put all your internals, yeah. What a crazy, like, method of of doing things, removing everyone's fucking organs. That's just their tradition, you know? It's just what they did. Is it possible to get mummified anymore? <laughs> I mean, if you pay enough money, I'm sure you can. I want all my organs in some cool jars. What would you want your jar to be? Because they all had different types. They were the gods, right? You know, different stuff. Or like, which one would yours be? Maybe Dwayne DeWalk Johnson on one of them. Oh, Jack Black. Like Maybe Jack. on another one, there's like a PlayStation controller or something like that. Minecraft Steve on a different one. Things like that. Just kind of things that I would like, like, you know, things like that. <laughs> yeah, that makes sense. And Nintendo. Maybe like Nintendo logo. I don't know, Super Mario. Maybe, maybe like Hot Cheetos or something like that. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what the f What he's, is going on there? He's using his telekinesis again. <laughs> that was ridiculous. <laughs> the professor's trousers? Poor man. Oh dear, somebody stripped down the old man and just took him through the naked. tomb. <laughs> there's a, there's a <laughs> fucking senile naked old man running around in this uh, ancient tomb. Oh shit, oh my god! Whee! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> uh, Tintin? Oh, he's fine. Okay. Oh my oh god, my god, it keeps clipping into the fucking rocks. <laughs> they didn't expect anyone to make it this far into the game, dude. Things are starting to fall apart. <sighs> <sighs> Oh my god! Oh my god! What happened to them all? Why are their eyes open? <laughs> this is D Walker. Are they dead? Oh my god, they're all fucking dead, dude. Look at this guy. Who is that? <laughs> he looks like every game reviewer ever. <laughs> oh my god, there's loads of them, yeah, dude. Yeah, there is, yeah. It's like the half of the ship. Holy shit. Are these all people that were on that ship with us? Probably not, right? They're just like random explorers. I think he's just random explorers that have died. Right. Oh my god. Oh my. 
<laughs> they have one for Snowy. <sighs> it's a professor. He's got no clothes on. <laughs> it's like a naked uh. old man in there. <laughs> We need to find a way out of here. Oh no! Oh my! Oh my God! The fucking gassing Tintin. Must <coughs> not <coughs> breathe. <coughs> Whoa! What? Oh my God! The <laughs> it's coming on. What? Snowy, we're we're high people. off the Zaza right now, dude. <laughs> what was that? Oh my god, oh my god, dude. What strain? What strain did they fucking put in the room, dude? This is insanity. <laughs> Let's say the sativa. This is like bath salts, dude. This is what happens when you do when you take bath salts. <laughs> Watch out, dude. Ant-Man's around the corner and the Quantum Maniac as well. Oh my god, the Quantum Maniac has to be around here. My favorite Teen Titans villain, the Quantum Maniac. This is this genuinely is like the Quantum Mania though. It's the Quantum Mania realm. This is this is like the closest thing to actually being the Quantumania that we've called the Quantumania. <laughs> yeah. We've called a lot of things the Quantumania. I definitely didn't expect it from the Tintin game. This is kind of cool. It is kind of cool. You know what it, it reminds me of? It reminds me of uh, when there's like the Spider-Man Mysterio missions. Oh, yeah. Or in Dishonored when you speak to the outsider. It's kind of like this. You go into like Dream Realm. You just trip balls. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh no. Anubis. It's Anubis. Holy shit. Gotcha. Whoa. We're going into the Wick and Morty verse, dude. We're going into the Wick and Morty verse. Oh, Flick. Watch out, there's Pickle Wick. Oh, this is flicking seriously fricked up. Pickle Wick, watch out. They must have carried us from the desert to the coast inside sarcophagi and boarded us onto a ship. Then, I guess they threw us overboard. But I doubt it was part of the plan. Too much trouble to get rid of our bodies. The day I find out who those crooks were, they'll be in trouble. Oh, dude, that guy on the left, that, that's the captain oh from the God. movie. Oh, my God. The guy who Tintin kept that picture of. Yeah, yeah, it's this man crush. Whoa, 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 what happened? What? You got saved by some sailors? A lot of shit just happened. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, they threw a lot at us. It was shown to us in just little pictures. I I'm gonna assume that that's their way of transitioning into Act Two. Oh my God! Look at the size of his head. <laughs> oh my God! He looks like the guy from that Zelda CDI thing that sells bombs. This guy looks horrifying. Wait, why is the water on fire over there? This game is fucking weird, dude. <laughs> What is going on? <laughs> Tintin Cigars of the Pharaoh. Uh, what, what do you think, dude? Do you think that this one's better than the PS3 game? Kind of hard to compare, but... I, I don't know if it's better. It's a completely different type yeah. of game. Yeah. This is like a more... It's more of like an adventure game. Like a classic style adventure this game. This is like what you'd expect more of when you think about a Tintin game, not a platformer. Yeah, yeah, exactly. There's no combat, nothing like that. It's a lot more... Adventury, I guess. And we still got, we still have one more PS5 release in November to play. Oh, not the Walking Dead Destinies. <laughs> thank you so much to the patrons. We appreciate your guys' support so much. Yeah, thank you kindly. We appreciate the support. If you want to join us on Patreon, head over there now. You can get access to uncensored videos, join our Discord, and even vote on future games on the channel. And we'll see you guys in the next video. Alright, we'll see you there! Bye.